Hi Dresser Cuties, Wendy here. Today we're going to be drawing a really cute little dinosaur inspired by this Squishmallow Dino right here. Isn't this the cutest thing ever? The color is just so perfect. This is my favorite green ever. And it has a little row of spikes right here that comes down and a little, little tail right here. And the face is just the sweetest little face ever. You can squash them, make them really flat <laughs> or you can make them really tall and skinny. They're just so, so soft. So if you've been following me, you know I love Squishmallows and I promise I was gonna show you some that I have. Well, I have a whole bunch, but I didn't want to um, make this a Squishmallow video, but look at these colors. Aren't they just gorgeous? <laughs> I even have one more right here, a panda. So if you love Squishmallows as much as I do, please make sure to check out my Squishmallows playlist. Um, but before I get carried away, <laughs> it's all about this little guy today. So get your Sharpie or your pencil ready and a piece of paper and let's get started. To draw this cute little dinosaur, we're gonna first start by drawing a curve for the top of the head. So we're basically going to draw the usual dumpling shape that I give to, oops, give to all my draw so cute um, animals. So just a big curve on the top and we're gonna get wider as we come down. To both sides. And let's bring it down more. So for this little Squishmallow pillow right here. And let's bring it down more. And then we're gonna start to round it off. So we just want this little elongated dumpling shape. And about right there, I'll we'll start to bring it in. And connect it at the bottom. Flattening it out a little bit. all the way back. There, let me fix my top of the head right here. Okay, so we have our basic shape in for our body. Now let's come in here and bring this cute little dinosaur to life. So in about this area right here, I'm gonna start and give it um, a circle right here for some eyes. So about right here, I'll start and draw a circle. And I'm gonna go across about right here. Draw another circle. And so let's make them draw so cute eyes. I'm gonna come in here with a highlight. So two small circles and a curve line at the bottom and shade in the top. And the lines at the bottom. So same thing over here. there. So then we have the eyes and let's come above the eye about right here. I'm just going to add a little curve on top of each eye and right in between let's give this little dinosaur a cute little smile right in between and cap it off. And then let's see here. Now let's come to the bottom right here. I'm basically just going to draw a curve that goes all the around, way around for the tummy area. So I'll start about right here. And I'm just gonna bring this all the way around and up. So about right there, bring it all the way around. And start to bring it down. And just bring it in, taper it in. There. <laughs> now let's give him some hands. The Squishmallow Pillow Dinosaur doesn't have any hands, but I just felt it really needed some. So I'm gonna add two little curves right here. So this one's optional if you wanna add hands or not. I'm just gonna add little, two little curves right there. So same thing on this side. And then let's see here. Let's come down here and we're gonna draw the tail. So about right here, Add a curve, comes down, 
round it off and we're going to taper it all the way back just pop it in there okay so now let's really make it look like a dinosaur we're going to add some of the spikes right here on top of the head so i'm going to come about right here and just draw the first one it's going to be the biggest and tallest one you're going to round off the top and bring it down so then i'm going to add some more here angling as i go down and it's going to come become shorter and smaller as i go so another one right here so it's up to you how many you want to add but it's going to get smaller as you go down so add one more right here and then right here we're going to pop up some more on the tail so say about right here i'm going to start and these are going to be more connected because it's on the tail so i'm just going to go three of them and um, that's pretty much it and of course I'm going to add a little heart right here to make it my draw so cute squishmallow dino so that's pretty much it for the drawing of this cute little dino pillow now to color it with some color pencils So there, hope you guys love my little dino drawing that was inspired by this cute little Squishmallow. If you guys want more drawings of Squishmallows, please let me know in the comments below which other ones you want me to draw. Thanks so much for watching and if you loved it, please give me a thumbs up and share it. And remember to subscribe so you won't miss any new Draw So Cute videos. See you later.